so excited. We were so excited that we'd escaped this. At least we have the Kiana, right? We have Kiana coming out mid lane for care. We're going to look at the bright side. And I mean, you kind of hit on it, right? Both teams having to today actually going for it early drake and let's hack it oh. something to say about it jumping on in the combo is there can they finish the job though drake taken down by weibo the shurikens are there but hacker has been abandoned all the laners just leave go a little bit deeper but i didn't know where weiwei was on the map at the time but here Ooh, we go. Suddenly the counter plays in the rocket comes on through an lwx it's a valiant attempt on the return damage but just overstaying overstepping and that's going to be two kills into the pocket a lot Hope that the rest of the team can follow up, you know, unless Care can find a flank. But Xiaohu, oh, Tib is flashed away from by Hacker. And here we go, Care oh. with the three man ulti. And the follow up is beautiful from FBX. Herald now taken. And Weiwei, next on the chopping block, realizes he's going down, commits to the play with a cyclone, looks for a bit of damage, but goes down anyway. And suddenly FBX are on the board. Even getting that battle song. Whereas Weibo still a little behind in that front. Care has been found. Turns invisible for a second here as Weiwei using that sweeper. But the stun is going to come on through. And there's one for Weibo. Xiaohu here alongside Weiwei who's buying time with the Cyclone. And LWX will be the next target. But the sustain is going to come on through. And the TP was cancelled. And so FBX come out on top. I mean, we see it ends up being a one for one at the end of the day. But... Still, I'm quite surprised to see Weibo even try to go for those plays without their AD carry. They do manage to pick up a turret, but you'd expect LWX to be able to answer the one in bot side. So, one for one. Drake spawned red well. through this one with the red and white weapons. Attempt number two with the rockets here from Light. It goes in. Oh. <laughs> when you have the flash up for care, we saw him being able to just jump across the river in that last play. So, it definitely feels like... There's a sapling going to spot uh, the players as uh, ultimates popped in the bottom side and LWX is here as well. But the Shy just jumps on top of him oh. and turns him to pieces. The Shy is does an absolute monster in the 2v1. I know how LWX doesn't have enough damage to take him down. Flash into the Empowered W. We don't get the replay because another Baron attempt munch. Yeah, FPX this time trying to do it. The rocket oh. goes wide again. So close. The timing's perfect, but the shy onto LWX once more. The stun comes in as here comes Light to try and carry this one. But the shy's already down. They have to find something. Shalahu misses the Q3. A great flash from Light to dodge it. But they can't find anything. Weibo can't. Yep. That implies that Weibo's going to win a game in this series. <laughs> it's, uh, could be a 2 0. Could be a 2 0. FBX certainly looking good at game number one. I'm, of course, joking. They are still the favorite, but three Drakes now picked up for FBX. And a bit of a gold lead. It's not much, but it is a gold lead nonetheless. Shallow. Just tanking up light for the time being as there goes Shahu's health bar. Care just finds it. Flash comes on through. Moonlight Vigil. It's enough. The proc on Crisp finishes Shahu. And now onto the chase. Hacker on the front line looking for the roots and he'll find it. But in they go onto LWX's Weiwei. On his lonesome though. Can't actually finish the kill off. The Shy in the meantime onto Hacker here. Trying to do the job. Trying to finish the damage. Look how much he's doing to the whole squad. But there's no support. There's no help. No, I mean, Light having to set up for the exact type of fight that FPX want. And it kind of came out of us talking about draft. It, it, it felt like they had more tool FPX and send Chow, who send the Shy, all jumping on top of LWX at once. But now that they're behind, they should never be able to find that positioning. Oh, oh I LWX like. has stepped too far forwards. Light just got to free fire for a bit. Weiwei could be the target instead, though. The Cyclone, the last prog hits him. As he goes down in the end. Oh, Indian River to deny this one, but Weibo not giving up and trying to find the picks that they need. Light Shall at least going to pack those time. damage numbers. TP. Actually, that's a double TP from the solo lane is here. as Care trying to threaten on the bottom side of the play. Weibo on the wrong side of the rift and Soul's already taken. The battle song to try and retreat, but they're already in too deep on this one, I fear. The Root's going to come across the team as Weiwei's looking for the flank. The Shy on the front line. We know he's comfortable here. Dives into the mix as they desperately try and get onto LWX, but he's just completely safe. He's completely fine in the backside. Shalahu is 1v3ing in the meantime, and Light oh. will go down. Shalahu massacring Weibo as LWX. They should be able to find it. I think that is going to be game. I think that is going to be game one. Going the way of FBX. Crisp 
And Xiaohu, what do you got in the tank? How can you hold on to this one? Because FPX are here to play. Crisp against his old team, against his bot lane partner from the World Championship. And LWX is winning this one out on top and fitting that LWX was the main part of the story. Pretty sizable gold lead early on. FPX, they are going to the patented full send composition. I, I love the full send. Everyone just goes in. You try and fight All the Chinese letters. I'm like, wait a second. It's Chocho -cho Flash. <laughs> Crisp, going to be knocked up here, but just kind of wanders away. Cho-Cho, can he find the hook? Yes, he can. It's onto Crisp, but the flash comes out. Keeps him alive. Held the the target all of a sudden. Oh. This light has gone way too deep for that one. And that's first blood taken by Cho-Cho. Weiwei's on the scene, but just doesn't have any damage. Like, what a timeline. FBX coming in so strong. Burn flash, topside, burn double summoner. Xiaohu finds oh. the solo kill. <laughs> Huge oh, coming no. out from Xiaohu. Can see LWX starting to move on over, whether he goes down to that bottom lane or goes to the Herald. Probably will depend what he sees. The Shy has to flash away and the whole gang is here. Good little dodge onto the ultimate. But I mean, what can you do in 1v4? Take it down by Hacker in the end. The Jack switch to top side to pick up Herald while we see FPX were taking this dragon. The mimic there as well. It's going to be really hard to take down. Gonna be okay for now. Uh, he's gonna face check into Hacker. No, he's not. Goes in onto Care instead. Oh. And uh, Hacker, bit of a whiff on that one. Trying to pretend to be a clone, but just gets bodied. I guess it doesn't matter if you hit your ultimate so long as you're hitting those auto attacks. And now down to the bottom side, Light goes for the all in onto LWX, but he doesn't quite have the damage. One more auto jumps forward for it, jumps oh, back out of tower it. range. Light absolutely smurfing on LWX. But Chocho hunting, hook available, W on cooldown for light, but he still has his flash here. Could flash for an execute at this point, but... You constantly have Pryo and try and get on these objectives. They want to try and force like a soul point, but light! Oh, they're going for LWX in trouble, but he's pulled back in light. Just invincible though. They don't have the damage to take him down. It looks for Chocho next, and one more auto gets the reset, but here comes Care, Hacker alongside him. But they're just going to commit onto Hacker here, as Care now tries to get onto the back side, but light just dashes away, and Xiaohu is here. To to turn this play around looking for care himself lwx2 just feels like lwx didn't even get to participate in the fight you no. know instantly struggled with no longer oh. is light just gonna flash forwards lwx and annihilates him this guy is an absolute madman he came out of nowhere yeah, with okay. that play you know remember earlier just that champ select, I was like, but well, has light practiced Tristan? Yeah, no, he's he's yeah. Getting, he's fine on the Tristana. The shy getting dived up in the top side here, low on HP, but gets a heal in the last second. Counter Strike comes on in, cares under the tower. The shy flashes away and care just about gets out of range. I cannot believe he was almost able to survive that, but still, Weibo gonna try and trade in the mid lane. Hell, even in bot, like. This is reminiscent to when Weibo picked up this composition before, right? Not caring about that topside drift here. They're like, ah, you maybe get one turret off of that, getting two turrets off their Then you're able to, to just take these turrets down. It has been so fun but, to see Tristana back only in this few days of play. Man, I will say, oh, hang on. I'm going to hold that thought as Care's in trouble. Oh, Care's not in trouble. Care Tristan doesn't exist anymore. God. <laughs> Shao <laughs> just rinses him. His light arrives and probably kills the tower just with the cannon there. Uh, look at this four bad stack of the top side as Herald comes down to answer from FPX in the bottom side of the map. They will. Uh, I was going to say they're going to bring Xiao. End up getting dove again. He might. The Herald does get its charge. Here comes Xiaohu and Crisp, though. The team is with him. I'm not sure this is a fight that they can commit to at this point. But tier two taken in the bottom side. At least they get that objective for themselves. Herald after, after the context of how it was done. So. Kudos to you as Weibo actually being the one to want to start off a fight themselves. Oh, they're just going to kill Hacker, aren't they? The Kraken Slayers do so much work. Zelda VX trying to survive, but the exhaust comes in once again. Chocho next time. No, 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 no. Light has no time for Chocho. It's AD carry on AD carry here. Weibo kind of low on HP as Kek jumps onto the back side here. Wants to find Light. It's Shalai who pulls him in. The knockbacks, and there we go. Perfect execution, but taken down. And that's just two of the players. There's still the rest of the team from Weibo. Shalai who the next target is the Counter Strike comes on in, and Shao who here to finish the job. The Shy with the kill. And Weibo look indomitable in this fight. What's that could have been? 
Uh, Weibo, though, doing a great job of, of seeing a moment where they had numbers advantage and taking advantage of the fact that they are at a pretty strong... I thought number. it was going to be Weibo <laughs> that it did. <laughs> it definitely was not the hype that, that you were trying to sell. And, I mean, this is good to see from... Oh, Cyclone! In. Oh, no. LWX in all kinds of trouble, and here comes Light to finish the job over the wall. One more auto! The bomb on Jojo is not even needed. Shout out who the next target is, the Shy. Realizing that there's a fight going on, joins his team. He's like, oh, sorry, guys. I was, uh, you know, I was pushing waves. Baron could be an option, but then again, Care could be an option. It's not often. You see the AD carry. Fights up before he's able to join in is so beautiful because, like, you know, five kill Akali, that really could be the thing to make a difference is the Shy. It's pretty bold. I, I think that's something we knew, so I'm not giving any new information, but... And uh, something you mentioned before, if there's one thing this team does, it's take Taos. Look at that shift damage, man. It's like a quarter of three different players' health and the entire minion wave. Like, that's not fair. It's just not fair. As uh, mid in him does go down. Pressure on them, which is going to allow mid wave to come in even smoother. It's going to do what we just saw, right? Opens up the angle to where FPX have to back off. And now the base is just in pieces. Because they wanted to dive on the bottom side of the Nexus. Uh, won't quite find their opportunity there as Care forced to flash away. Jojo! Oh, he finds the hook, but Light just buffers it and then flashes away from Shao who And I think that is the attempt over from the side of FBX. Care gets obliterated. It's a full-on demolition crew here for Weibo. And the targets are the towers. Here we go as they end the game. Light charging off forwards, knocks them <laughs> back onto the Nexus. He's having none of it. The Nexus towers will fall away, but they're going to want some extra kills, aren't they? They're going to want to finish FBX off, but they are about to get low. That kind of strike is huge from the Shy. They can't actually finish the players. Get the Nexus, guys. Yeah, change of targets here. It's way more two pushes to. Yeah, and for FPX, I mean. Good. You have a bunch of like beefcake frontliners in front of your double marksmen. Again, you're great at taking objectives. You're front to back. Exactly. <laughs> WE, the roller coaster, if you will, of the LPL, but not in a, not in an emotional way. Just in a. Yeah, I don't know. This is this analogy is falling apart. You finally, uh, see the, the side exec come oh, online from FBX. For God's sake! They're playing <laughs> in an extremity. Not good from Chocho, -Cho, but. They're gonna just get caught by the root. It's a first blood going the way of Chocho, actually, as Weiwei flashes underneath the tower. That should be enough to finish this tower off. LWX will be very happily the, the benefactor of all of this as he'll get the first tower off the game. And Weibo falling pretty dramatically. To set up for the follow through. And me and you both kind of hinted at that we liked. We, we... That top tier one tower looking awfully juicy, but actually Harold not even needed for this one. We've got... Lane. But we can see now they're starting to get pressured and they're going to have to look for this. TP going to come on through. Harold doesn't even need to charge. He's going to go for the second tower instead, but the solo laners are behind enemy lines here. Oh, knocked back. Care denies the swoop of Boopers. Shaolau, who trying to deny the rest of the team coming on in. The Sand Soldiers are there to buy space for the team as in they charge, but health bar still low and Light taken over the wall. Needs support and gets it from his teammates, but Shaolau goes down in the meantime. And now the Shy chased out. Counter-Strike comes in onto Care. No way does he turn that around. Double kill for LWX is the shot. Uh, it felt like an impossible fight almost. It's the shy just trying to make individual heroics happen on the back line. I feel like it's. Mind. Which is the way that JoJo's played throughout his career of being like that absolute balls to the wall type of player. Of, of our playoffs standings. Like NIV, yeah. EDG, not convincing. There we go. Hooks coming on through. JoJo tanking on the front line. Is he tanky enough though? Shaolau Hu behind enemy lines as the Shy threatens the rest of FBX. Shaolau Hu can't go in by himself. Chris holding the way for now. It's Baron, but losing the Drake. That's going to be sole point for FBX. And you know, Pastry maybe. This TP out, and there it is. TP comes on through. They're just going to 50 50, aren't they? 3K on the Baron right now as the team fight kicks off. Shaolau Hu on the front line. Hackers low on the back of the pit as well. And this is working out. The long range carries paying dividends for Weibo. Hacker forced out and taken down. LWX falls as well. And Weibo have blown this game wide open. It looked so good for FBX the entire game long. But now. Where Mojo's involved. 
and it definitely looked like that coming from Weibo, who now with this Baron buff are really going to start to be able to bail. Sh Shala, who Hacker, Chocho, they were all already half HP, and not the same damage able to be put in response by Weibo. Well, they don't yet. I'm hoping it'll catch on. So, guys, what? start. If you could start calling him the beer man. There we go. Uh, Shao, oh, he's gone? Oh, no. <laughs> he's not well, the bird man much. He's not he's the, not the bird man. He's absolutely not the bird man. Chris, can we dog back as well? What just happened? What Wait, is going winning? on? They got Baron. Well, they don't have Baron anymore, at least on two members. And now FPX going to try and utilize these death timers gonna try to utilize the fact that they can at least break open the base. Barrened up minions with a pretty decent frontline might be enough for Weibo to dissuade, but Light still hasn't gotten off his base yet. <laughs> this is gonna be at least one inhibitor. They might be able to finish the game, but the Shy Light, way, way all here, should be enough to hold on to the game for now. I don't know how we're in a position where Weibo are holding on to the game after the fact they have no buildings in their mid lane. So FPX can't really threaten the mid lane push instead. Drake will be taken here. Weibo have played it well so far. Do they want the fight? Root's going to come on through. Shalahu on that front line buffers it for his team. The Roots might get them out here. Hacker finds the engage onto Weibo. He flashes back to the rest of his team. Pulled back in though and will go down. FBX find a pick off the back of it. OTP? And OTPs into the base. Can they end in time? Xiaohu sliding across the map as Light is barreling towards the base as well. Xiaohu's got to make a miracle happen. Still has the Empress Divide. Could just push the minion wave away if necessary. Replaces the tower that fell. And Weibo will hold on. This is one of the most tense games of the split so far, and I would have never expected it to come between Weibo and FPX. Crisp and LWX really going at it, and it's LWX for now, helping push down these turrets into the base. Shao Hu finds a moment once again, finds the target. Shao Hu taken down. The better Tiger wins it out, but falls out in the end of the oh, shot. Shy. Dives onto the back line. Almost finishes LWX. It's light. It's crisp. Alive. Wei Wei respawning. They've held on for now. Wei Wei almost has his roots available if they want to try and find a fight. Green and purple weapons, not ideal. No, and with Care still here and Care being so healthy, I feel like that's why they feel really confident about looking for this. But it's all going to be oh, about Light Infernum. what he's able to do. That's Infernum! They're all grouped up. He's got Infernum and he's going to oh. burn through the whole team. Care though, popping off on the opposite side, trying to end the game. Jump straight on towards Light. But Light turns it around. No! It's over. Finally falls in the end. Care's got oh, wait, one wait. HP. Wait, wait, doesn't have any damage to the Nexus. is bad. Wei Wei is buying time because Shahu's up in just five seconds. And Ken doesn't have the damage to actually finish the game here. Shahu respawns. Home guard flashes forward and finds Ken. He, he saves the game. How? How is this game? And now the siege starts once again, but look at care get side lanes in order didn't have tp this time so if any engage came out weibo would be favored but i like it back up a little bit give this turret up and let care rejoin which speaking of he has a stopwatch oh, oh it's a hook chocho the target i don't know if that's really the target they want to go for the braum escapes with his life Moonlight Vigil across the team. It's a knockup as well. Weibo have kind of used everything and they're still going for the play. Hacker the target here, but Weiwei's going to go down too. Jungler for jungler is the shy. Jumps back into the fray again. The counter strike is there. Shalahu behind the enemy lines now. This is the moment, but Shalahu going to use WWE survives though. And Crisp will fall. FBX have done it. FBX with the huge team fight to be able to take the game. Gonna deliver a loss to Weibo. Gonna move their way up and put themselves in the playoff picture. Such a confident fight from Weibo, but FBX happy to take the front to back and care. Seven, one, and six to finish things out. FBX deliver a massive upset to Weibo. Great from them. Great.